Okay, so someone has asked me to cast for them some a few letters in 18 point uh, swing bald, which is monotype number 217. Basically he has almost no capital S's, so he wants 50 of those. And he'd also like some capital C's and capital T's. So, I'm going to have to match whatever alignment he has, so he can mix them in with the rest of his font and not have any problems. Fortunately, he sent me one sample of each letter. So, first I'm going to measure these, just to make sure the sizing is correct. Because if the sizing is wrong, that makes things even more difficult for me. Now, just out of curiosity, not that I can do anything about it, I'm going to measure the height of the letter, or the height of the bottom, the, essentially the point size. And this is unfortunately an inch micrometer, not a point one. So I have to get the numbers in inches, and that's point two, four, eight, seven. Point two four eight seven on the S. Let's see if the the foot is any different. Uh, it's point two four nine zero, and near the top, it is point two four eight seven again. And we have the C. 0.2486 in the middle and 0.2487 at the foot and 0.2488 at the head and the capital T 0.2486 again now uh, 12 point Sorry, 18 point is actually uh, 0.249 inches. So these are about um, three to four ten thousandths of an inch smaller than they should be. As for the width, back to the S first. That is 0.1. Three one six. I'll measure it again on a different spot. Point one three one four. And the C is point one one eight eight. Here I have 0.1186 at the other end. And finally, the T is 0 0.1423. 0.1420 at the foot. So the question is, what are the proper widths? So 18 point, same bold, I want this capital C. And it says its width is starred 10 and 4, which would be uh, 10 points and 4 eighths. So it would be 10 and a half points. One off. S is ten and eight, which is um, with a star. So that's ten and eight eighths, which is eleven points wide. And T is starred ten and eight. That's eleven points wide. So the S and the T are supposed to be the same width. So one of these is not cast to specification. So I have to get, I get back to the guy I'm doing this work for to find out what's up. Yes, yeah, so even looking at them, you can see the T is obviously wider than the S. So the real question is here, 
What are the widths supposed to be? Get my handy dandy slide rule out here. Let's see, a point is 0.166 on the button divided by 12 on the button, which is 0 0.0138, well, 0 0.0138 as far as I can tell with this. And if I multiply that by 11, I get 0.15. 2-0, and I multiply it by 10 and a half, I get 0.1451. So none of these letters are cast according to the widths set on the mats. They are all cast narrower. evidently to encourage a very tight fit between the letters. So I guess I'm going to have to duplicate those tight fits if I want to get him letters that match the ones he already has. I'm going to email him and just verify that. <laughs> 